So long heritage here, actually started out as a 160 acre purchase and many acres were added after that to make the total acreage here 750 acres. Well, it actually started through the Sensei Men's Horticulture Society. They were looking for an expanded area away from downtown Cincinnati and finally decided upon this particular area that was just a few miles outside of the city limits. Total number of burials, uh, just over 225,000, so uh, a, lot of, uh, a lot of memories are held here at Spring Grove. Memorial Day weekend is certainly our largest uh, weekend of the year from the standpoint of visitors. There'll be just about 10,000 that will come through the gates to honor those who have gone before and so a lot of different activities. Certainly it starts out with the scouts who uh, very methodically come in and put flags on each of our uh, veterans areas so that's pretty inspirational. The American Legion event will be here on uh, Sunday. We'll have a Civil War walking tour. It's, it's not only Memorial Day, and certainly uh, many people come just uh, any day of the year. In fact, we're open every single day of the year for uh, visitors to come in. We're, we're never closed, so seven days a week, uh, all 365 days, people can come in and certainly uh, walk, bicycle, enjoy the various sights, nature, and certainly honor, again, those who have gone before. Even 40 years ago, Memorial Day was just celebrated on the one single Memorial Day. Uh, currently, as you well know today, it's a three-day celebrated weekend, but it always has been certainly a cherished time of the year to honor those who have served uh, our great country. So uh, it's always been a very, very uh, inspiration and memorable event. Uh, uh, we even have cenotaphs uh, recognizing uh, those people, uh, seven Medal of Honor recipients. So, uh, quite inspirational, the heritage that uh, Spring Grove does provide the area.